start next week. They run from August 24th to September 5th right here on 12 News. And not only does Arizona have several athletes competing, it also has a one-of-a-kind sports and fitness center that's helped a few Paralympians prepare for Tokyo. Team 12's Jen Wall joins us live this morning. She's at Ability360. So Jen, what do they do there? Yeah, good morning to you. This center is incredible. You can literally do just about anything active that you can imagine from swimming to rock wall climbing and lifting weights. We'll show that to you in just a second. But the Paralympians, yes, some of them, the local ones, they train right here at Ability360. And joining me live is Brielle Carter. Good morning to you. Good morning. We are so excited to see Team USA compete in Tokyo in just a few days. So Brielle, how many Paralympians do you have train here and what is that like? Absolutely. So over the past 10 years of being open, we've had 100 Paralympic athletes come in the facility and train here for various sports, wheelchair rugby, wheelchair basketball, swimming, para canoe, para kayak, um, hand cycling, para triathlon. Um, we've also hosted several international competitions as well with Team Canada, Australia, and Colombia to help get our Phoenix athletes Team USA athletes ready for the Tokyo and other various games. All right, Brielle, thank you so much. And it is such an awesome place. I got an inside look at all of the different ways that you can work out here, and we want to show that to you right now. After breaking his neck in a snowboarding accident, Corey Lovato wanted to continue his active lifestyle in his wheelchair. That's always been a big part of my life, and it is here. Uh, it's really nice to be able to get into the gym and work out. Um, feel like you really kind of are back in your body, I guess. Phoenix's Ability360 Sports and Fitness Center makes it possible for Lovato to stay active. Roll up to any of the machines and uh, start working out right from the chair. Lovato appreciates the freedom the Ability360 gym provides for seniors, military members, and people with disabilities and their families. Uh, I like to lift weights. I'll go around the track sometimes if I'm a little bit sore. Ability360 is also home to Paralympians who train and work here. And it's kind of a 360 full circle experience. We're providing the work experience so they can work and train and make a living and uh, represent Phoenix, Arizona and, and the United States and Tokyo. The center is a venue for local to international adaptive sporting events too says senior manager Brielle Carter. We have a youth swim team, a master swim team, we do aquatics classes, we do adaptive scuba diving, um, we do uh, adaptive uh, kayaking and paddle boarding. We also have a 35 foot high rock wall. An array of activities promoting health and independence. For Lovato, an Ability360 board member and a staff attorney, this gym is a place that keeps him busy outside, too. Uh, but also to be able to go out and do sports again, you know, you need the strength to be able to do that, and training in here is what makes it so that I can go do that out there. And we thank the folks at Ability360 for giving us the tour of their center. Coming up live at 6.30 a.m., we're going to head out to the pool because that's where the swimmers train. And then this weekend, they're hosting a camp here to train coaches with hopes of bringing in future Paralympians to train right here in Phoenix. Brian and Rachel.